What's up everybody, Mikkel Bird, MacTown TV, the dopest show in every dimension, and today I'm going to be uh, doing a reaction video. Uh, this video comes from WPLG Local 10, and uh, today the video I'm going to be reacting to is called Man Accused of Setting Pregnant Girlfriend on Fire Arrested. So let's, let's do the reaction. New at 530, police have arrested a man accused of setting his girlfriend on fire four years ago. Noel Grulon is charged with attempted second degree murder and aggravated battery. Grulon has been on the run since July 2017 after Hylia police say he doused his girlfriend with gasoline and lit her on fire following a domestic dispute. The victim was pregnant at the time with his child and was left with second degree burns. And he appeared in court today where a judge ordered him to stay away from the victim and have no contact with her. Okay, so right off the bat, they didn't say why. I guess they don't know why. They didn't say why this guy set his pregnant girlfriend on fire. But I can tell you this. This guy's completely fucking psychotic. And as you can see from the video, he actually looks like a fucking homeless guy. He looks like some crazy fucking meth head bum who would probably do something like that. So, number one, let me say this. I don't agree with anything he did. I'm not going to defend this man in any way. You set your pregnant girlfriend on fire. It's absolutely insane. Uh, you deserve to be publicly executed, in my opinion. You deserve to be executed uh, Chinese military style or Chinese prison style where they just take you and shoot you in the back of the fucking head. That's what that guy deserves, to be honest with you. But... This is just me making an educated guess, right? And I, and I don't know. This is just me, this is an educated guess. I think that this guy probably found out that she cheated or some shit like that. Or perhaps this guy didn't know. Like, he, maybe he thought that the baby wasn't his. And, you know, he had his suspicions and he was... I mean, if you look at the guy from the video, you can see in the video, he looks like he's fucking crazy. So that's part one. I think that he might have thought that she cheated or maybe she told him she cheated or option three, for whatever reason, he just suspected that the child wasn't his. Because usually that's what it would take to get somebody to, like, do something that fucking crazy. That's when a guy snaps, you know what I mean? When he finds out his girlfriend's cheating, or he finds out his kid is not his, that's when he snaps and does super crazy shit like that. But uh, they didn't say it in the video, you know what I mean? But I am glad this guy got arrested, I'm glad he's in jail. And another quick side note I want to make is, you know, I'm kind of questioning the woman, as, and I have to do this often, like, why would a woman marry a man like this? You know what I mean? You can clearly tell just looking at this guy, he's not boyfriend material, he's not marriage material, he looks completely fucking psychotic, he looks like he's a fucking homeless guy who lives under the bridge, he's been hiding for years, the police finally found him. We can tell this guy isn't that bright because even as a criminal, if you were a bright criminal, like an intelligent criminal, you would have if you if you committed a crime that heinous, you would think that this guy would get the fuck out of the country or something. Like he would go hide in the woods or some shit. Like the Olympic bomber in 1996 in Atlanta, that guy was hiding in the woods for years before they found him. And if you're going to commit a crime that fucking heinous, that's the type of shit you would expect somebody to do, but you could just look at this guy and tell that he's not that bright. He's just some bum-ass fucking-looking meth head. And, uh, you know, he deserves to be publicly executed. Fuck all this court shit. You know, you could do the court. You could do the trial. But, you know, once he's found guilty, fuck all this keep him in jail shit. Let's just go ahead and execute him immediately. That's what I think. But that's that, people. Uh, Mikkel Bird, MacTown TV, MacTown Radio, the dopest show in every dimension. Don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. Don't forget to hit the bell notification for all. And don't forget to drop a comment. Uh, tell me if you got any videos you want me to react to. If you got anything you want to promote, let me know. You know, engage with me on MacTown TV because I'm a very responsive person, all right?